welcome to this another episode with me arshi and i'm here with another episode or this episode jo hai wo sabhi cmat aspirants ke liye bahut important hai because har student jo cmat 2023 dene wala hai uske dimag mein ek question hai ki how should i score 95 plus percentile in cmat so that you know i'll be able to get into all those top colleges jo, jo cmat ke through hum target kar sakte hain I have Brijwal with me who already scored 97 plus percentile in CMAT. So Brijwal, over to you. How was your journey and how you can you know tell the aspirants so that you know it will be beneficial for them? Because अभी time तो बहुत कम बचा हुआ है. Date कभी भी आ सकती है. So what is your suggestion? How was uh, you know what do you want to say to the aspirants? Yeah. Uh, my name is Brijwal. As Arshi gave a little brief about me, my percentile and all. So I'll just. uh suggest them that guys just chill don't worry don't stress yourself much you have already been through cat you have given your snap exams you have given your zat you have given your tis exams maybe you might be preparing for your mhct as well so it's just that work on your uh, you can say voids which you have left during your preparations learn from the mistakes you have uh, been doing all the way by giving like Four five exams you have been so I'll just suggest them to work on your uh, like the places where you are lagging and not stressing it much. Give more importance to uh, like scoring uh, by attempting the right answers rather than attempting all of them. I I would say but uh, in case if we take CMAT to be uh, like specific, CMAT is something where you have to score as well as you have to make sure that the every question you attempt is right. so you for according to me i feel that uh, at my chance uh, there was two uh, two and half hours for uh, like lrdi logic reasoning english like grammar vocab and uh, the last one was quantitative section and post that uh, we had one gk section as well which was for half an hour so our tricky part was gk questions because the gk questions itself were very much tough at our phase so if at all you personally any of the candidate who is Uh, like uh, feeling that the questions are little bit on the tough side so it's better you attempt very less in that particular section but in lrdi in cons and in uh, english you, you make sure that you are scoring um, like there are 25 questions each if you can uh, consider so try solving for more than 22 questions to be right then only you can aim for uh, 95 plus percentile or as you can say 97 plus percentile okay and any suggestions any last few days trips or tricks what you want to give it to these students yeah so particularly i would give more emphasis on solving mock test giving more mock test uh, like going on repetitive mock test wherein the candidate can know uh, the time as well as the amount of questions he is able to attempt and also with the uh, like the degree of uh, uh, brightness you can say or making every specific question right so that all can be attained by giving regular mocks only uh, now since i guess what 10 or 12 days must be remaining for the another cmat attempt so i'll suggest them to focus on giving at least two mocks per day which even was my strategy and just analyze the mocks after you give uh, just go on reviewing the mocks because there only you will find your mistakes just work on it and give another mock so it should be that schedule it's not the time to prepare something new it's the time to just stick to your strategy have your own strategy like see your weak points see your strong points make sure that your strong points here you are gaining marks and your weak points you are not losing out on marks just you can omit it or you can lose uh, a question or two maybe but at least out of 25 you should try to make 22 questions right Okay, Prajwal. Thank you so much for your time. I think I'm done with my questions. Thank yeah. you, and I think definitely this video will help a lot of aspirants. So yeah, thank, thank you. you. Okay. Thank you.